Decision making is a skill. Don't we all make decisions every day? What do you mean decision making is a skill? Isn't it a habit that everyone has to do in life? I thought it was, but no. I remember when I first met my original coach in personal development, she asked me for my credit card and I sheepishly said, can you give me a couple of days to work it out? To which she promptly replied, no. And then I answered, oh, well, I don't think I can do this. And just to give you some context, the investment for the program she was offering was around 10,000 Australian dollars. My bank balance had possibly $50. My credit rating was bordering on average and my comfort level in asking someone for a loan was even lower than my credit rating. I was thinking, how the heck am I gonna do this? Now, I knew I wanted to do the program, but my conscious, logical mind was definitely not agreeing. After my reply of not being able to move forward, she asked, why not? I explained quite embarrassingly that I didn't have the money. Her next response was, you know, it's not about the money. And that was an answer <laughs> I agreed with theoretically, but I couldn't shift out of worry, fear and doubt. Next up, she said, do you want to learn how to make a better decision? Quite confused, <laughs> I replied, yeah, sure. Okay. She says, this is how it works. There's only one answer, yes or no. Do you want to work with me? And hurriedly, I replied, yes, absolutely. Wonderful, she replied. How do you feel? I said, feels great, <laughs> but I'm still unsure how I'm going to pay you. The next part will help you understand how to apply this in your life. She explained, we're brought up being taught to make a decision after you've dotted the I's and crossed the T's. However, it's logic that got you into this position and it's imagination and intuition that will get you out. You see, we already have the answer towards things we wanna do, except we allow our current reality, our history, our personality, our habits to dictate whether we can or cannot. Make the decision that you will or will not do this. If it's a yes, keep your commitment. That's the secret. In Napoleon Hill's legacy of a book called Think and Grow Rich, he mentions that of the 500 of the most successful people that he interviewed, the only thing, and I repeat, the only thing that they could all agree upon was making quick decisions and changing, changing their minds slowly, if at all. I've applied that rule in my life and it's 100% true. Try today. Commit to this exercise for 30 days and see what happens.